Okay, welcome to our part two uh, of today's unboxing where we're going to do the adult books and the DVDs. And I'm Eliza. I'm Amber. Here we go. So, first up, Fiction, Fiction, Judgment by Joseph Finder. Uh, it's sort of like a thriller, right? An explosive thriller oh, about a female like judge and the one personal misstep that could lead to her downfall. <laughs> uh, Matthew Quirk, the night agent, and this is another, like, probably explosive thriller, I'm going to guess. <laughs> uh, maybe we'll just save those until, okay, we'll do, okay. The, we'll do the books first, right? Sure. Um, Go to My Grave by Catriona McPherson. I haven't heard that name before. Um... A clever, oh, it's like an Agatha Christie take Ooh. on a gothic thriller. That sounds, I, that sounds like more like my kind of thing. Okay. The House Witch. I think this is a new edition of like an older book. It says, your complete guide to creating a magical space with rituals and spells for hearth and home. Hmm. And I'm not like a, a spell caster person myself, but I really like this book. It's just got this like beautiful it really has, paper and they did a really nice yeah. job. Like the texture. It's a nonfiction book. Nonfiction. So. Um, Mar-a-Lago, Inside the Gates of Power at Donald Trump's Presidential Palace. This seems a little bit biased to one side, so I guess we'll see. Uh, okay. The quote on the back, which we're not going to read because it has inappropriate language, but it, um, yeah, it feels like some people are going to be really into this. It's about where he got his start in yeah. his natural habitat, Palm Beach, Florida. <laughs> so, okay. you know, it's another Trump book. Um, the Only Woman in the Room. This is historical fiction by the author of Carnegie's Main and Maid and the Other Einstein. And um, this is about... Doopy -doo, doopy -doo. <laughs> oh, it's about Hedy Lamarr, who has this crazy life, right? Where she was this... Is she an actress? She was a film star, yeah. She's like in, in Hollywood. But before that, she had married an Austrian arms dealer who got... Um, and uh, like got involved with the Nazi party. And then she had fled to the United States where she became a film star, but she was also a scientist and inventor and did all these patents. I didn't know that part. <laughs> huh. Interesting. Um, the Suspect by Fiona Barton. A lot of thrillers coming in. I think that's just what's out these days. It's a twisting psychological suspense about every parent's worst nightmare. No thank you. <laughs> No. Greg Hurwitz, Out of the Dark, another thriller. <laughs> People really want to be thrilled. I mean, it's January, so. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and this one has to do with the government's orphan program and off the books assassins operation versus all of the on the books assassins operations. <laughs> uh, yep. Uh, James Rollins, Crucible. He's a popular author, right? This is. Um... Oh, gosh, there's a lot here to read. Wow. I have a feeling it's, it's like... a Sigma for... No, is this religious this this... type thing? Oh, it looks... It says a thriller. <laughs> it's a thriller. So... <laughs> and for a change of pace, we have Peppa Pig. <laughs> Not a thriller. But the kids, nonetheless, are thrilled to watch Peppa Pig and get very addicted. Sorry, I know the light is weird. It's hard to see. My kid has never watched Peppa Pig oh. and will never watch. Oh, whoops, we had one more book. One more book. The Rule of Law, John Lescroix. Le Croix. Le um, Le Croix. It look yeah, it's a legal thriller. <laughs> we have many types of thrillers. <laughs> You'll be thrilled. First Man with Ryan Gosling, and this is about um, landing on the moon. I have to say that this is not something I like desperately want to watch a movie about, but I think a lot of other people do. It looked kind of interesting. I mean, Ryan Gosling. He is I, interesting. He's interesting. I mean, he's a really good actor. He's well known, but it's, yeah, didn't have that. I have to go and see it. Hunter Killer. <laughs> Probably, yeah. I don't know how they come up these names, but it's Gerard I, Butler, so I guess that sounds I like right. Hunter Killer because it's just so straightforward. Like, you know what you're getting. You this is an getting. action. Yeah. It's an action. Oh, 
Ooh, Castle Rock, the <gasps> new TV series based on uh, Stephen King um, pairing fictional. with J.J. Abrams, which are two like really big names. That's so crazy that they're working together. And this is the one that's filmed in Orange, right? Right near us. This so, is like this is this brings together a lot of Stephen King's fictional characters into mm -hmm. one place. And look, you have the clown from it, the kid, the kid from it. Um, mm -hmm. I forgot. This is on Netflix, and I kept meaning to oh. watch it. I think I haven't talked to anybody who watches it, but I'm really intrigued. Me either. Um, the Hate You Give. This will probably. This probably has a lot of holds on it. I'd imagine. Yeah, I think so. I re I read the book, and it was really good. I don't really know. I've heard the movie is good, but I definitely can recommend the book. I think this is just another First Man. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So apparently a lot of people want to watch it. A lot of people want to watch First Man, and we don't have any more movies, but more will come. That's it. See ya.